this is the follow on from the, uh, the last video and we've got a box here with capacitors in that will drive this three phase motor and you notice we've got a button here which is the start button so we'll just do a quick drawing to remind people of where we're at we have the the motor in delta with the coils we have live and neutral so let's put live to there and neutral to there and then off the live we have a capacitor to there and then in addition to that we have the press button and another capacitor to there or there or wherever so we double the capacitance or treble it just for the start now I'll just zoom in and we'll uh, just have a look inside the box So let's just have a brief description of what's going in, or an explanation. This is the mains in, of which we've got brown, which is the live, blue, which is the neutral, and an earth. And the earth goes through there, down that yellow wire, and off to the chassis. So the motor wires are this black wire here, of which we've got brown, blue, and what was the earth which is the green and yellow and we've used that green and yellow as the third connection so the live comes up here and there are three wires coming out of the other side of the live one is the brown that goes directly to the motor and the other two are the capacitors the start capa the run capacitor which is this one there's the run capacitor comes out of the run capacitor to the third connection the start capacitor which is this wire here there's the start capacitor goes to the start capacitor out through the switch and then back to the third connection this capacitor which is the run capacitor is 14 microfarads it could be a little bit more but that's the only one I've got and that one which is the start capacitor which is a 40 microfarad again it's a bit on the large side but it doesn't really matter because it's only connected for a second so there you go run start and the starts connected through the switch hopefully that makes some sense and of course the block of wood in the middle is just keeping everything in place so we just put the the front on we'll just try and start it now so switch the mains on and the motors just come in press the button there we go So I think what we could do now is just check the voltage across the capacitor when it's running. So I'll switch it off. So it's the voltage across this capacitor here, which again would be across um, the third connection and either of the other two so let's stick the meter on 700 volts AC 
switch it on, switch the motor on, press, now I don't know whether you'll be able to see this but let's, you definitely know it won't when I'm holding it there, 206 volts and across the live and the third 228 so we're not over voltaging it could be the capacity could be just slightly larger but for this situation where we've got a lot of gearing and it's gearing down I suspect it won't matter hopefully that will uh, clear up a few issues various people have emailed me through um, YouTube messages asking technical details which I've replied to and I think it's great that people are showing an interest so there's a practical application of the start capacitor